do we describe this shirt as? And who picked this out? Was it you or your wife? <laughs> well, it's actually an old college shirt, so uh, I picked it out, but I had to get her approval first. Um, yeah, we all do, right? <laughs> exactly. Especially, unfortunately, we're celebrating our first Valentine's Day as a married couple apart. Uh, she had to work the Monona Grove hockey game tonight. She's an athletic trainer at Monona Grove. Um, so it's a happy Valentine's Day for me, nonetheless, but it'll be nice to go home and enjoy it with her. Uh, late, regardless of the shirt I'm wearing. Late night date? <laughs> well, I, I, to be honest, uh, I haven't had the best focus on her, so I'll definitely have to stop. I don't know, PDQ might be the only place open and pick up some flowers for her because <laughs> she's my rock, and without her I wouldn't be able to devote half the time I can to these guys, and um, she, she's just a blessing to me. You want to talk about this one, you, you got to lead, I think, about 14, but you know Oregon's going to come back, and it got down to four points. <laughs> What was kind of the message at that point? Well, I think the message has been when it's been all year in our conference, and that is talent doesn't necessarily always win um, in the Badger South Conference. Toughness does, and not just physical toughness, but you need mental toughness. And you saw a team tonight that bent a little bit, but they didn't break. And um, ultimately, when we needed to make a play, we were able to do that. When we needed to get a stop, we were able to secure a stop, and um, it ultimately led to us coming out on the positive end of uh, this game tonight. Hey, talk about uh, when it got down to four. The guys kind of rode uh, Bruziger and from the scoring standpoint, but as he pointed out, it was guys getting into the ball, making stops, and uh, definitely everybody uh, just came to the front right there. Well, I think when you watch this play, you see a very unselfish team. Um, they're selfless um, by nature and that they don't care whose name goes in the paper. In fact, I don't know if half of them even read a paper um, or look at a stat sheet. They just want to come out, and it's a group that's truly a family, and that's kind of been our motto all year. Stay together, stay as one family, and you saw that uh, throughout the course of the night. Guys were unselfish, guys were making the extra pass, um, and ultimately it led to us getting some easy baskets, and you saw that at the end of the game. Thanks.